I had a great day in Haifa today. Haifa is a beautiful city. It's beautiful because of its physical setting uh, on the bay uh, overlooking uh, the Mediterranean, but it's also beautiful because of its people uh, and because of the spirit of tolerance and community and coexistence. I started at GE Healthcare, a great example of an American company uh, that has uh, made a very successful investment in its technology development by basing operations in Israel. Uh, here they manufacture uh, ultrasound equipment for cardiac uh, tr patients uh, and it's very high-tech uh, medical equipment uh, that was developed here, is manufactured here and exported uh, to hospitals around the world. What we see here is the position of the four chambers. Mm -hmm. Uh, this is the mitral valve. It's looking good. Yeah. You can see... Yeah, a nice flow of blood yes. there. <laughs> Maratech, uh, the science museum, which is set in a historic building that used to house uh, the Technion, a beautiful building uh, which now has very exciting exhibits that don't just teach children about science, but actually draw them in, get them excited, let them put their hands on it, uh, let them really experience. That's the best way to get young people excited about science. They've especially come to enjoy the new Noble Energy Science Park that's based at the museum. I had a chance to try some of the fun attractions there, including uh, riding a helicopter in a rainstorm. I can't wait to go back with my kids. America Day uh, at the Haifa University, where the U.S. Embassy brought uh, our experts from our consular section, our cultural section, our education exchange programs, and our commercial section uh, to help uh, expose the students of Haifa University to the kinds of exchanges and the kinds of cooperation that we can do between uh, the United States and Israel. I met with President Ben Zaev. Uh, I addressed students at a town hall meeting and uh, heard some very interesting and challenging questions from them. I ended the day with a visit at Beit HaGefen, an Arab Jewish center in Haifa, uh, which brings together Arab and Jewish residents of the city uh, to work together on a range of projects. I heard that peace between people of different communities, different religions, different backgrounds is possible. It's possible when people decide that what's most important is finding the common humanity that they have with their fellow human beings, whatever their background. That's a message I hope will spread uh, throughout Israel, uh, throughout the Middle East, throughout the world. Uh, people here in Haifa have a lot to teach the rest of the world.